Hello, and welcome to yet another episode, because I'm recording a ton back to back. Well, we're going into the Citadel of Mass Effect Legendary Edition. This is really cool, actually. Obviously, security has tightened since you were last here. Shut it down. What? Do you seriously think? Yeah, okay. Sorry for the inconvenience, sir. Our scanners are picking up false readings. They seem to think you're uh, dead. Technically, I was. I was listed as missing in action a couple of years ago. Would you mind checking in with my captain? He can reinstate you in our system. He's just past the scanners on your right. Sure thing, buddy. Good try. Oh, a map! And oh my god, it is cluttered. I am very confused. Um, CSEC Captain Bailey is here. Okay. You'll have to make him scream a little. He's not gonna tell you everything just because you ask. I, I know, sir. If you don't have the stomach or you're worried about being reported, I can take care of it. No, sir. I can handle it. Oh, okay, that's a bit dark. Yes, I see the problem already, Commander Shepard. My console says you're dead. So you're not worried I'm some imposter claiming to be me? We have the best screening equipment in the galaxy. Those scanners can sample DNA from skin flakes. Hell, if you have unregistered gene mods, they can even figure those out. Nice. Can you fix it? Your sergeant said you could help with that. Usually, you'd have to go through the station security administration to reactivate your IDs, then to customs and immigration to regain access to the Citadel itself, and probably a stop by the treasury. Spending a year dead is a popular tax dodge. But I can see you're a busy man. So how about I just press this button right here, and we call it done. Is that legal? Couldn't one of us or both of us get into trouble for that? There's no way to fool the DNA scanners in that tunnel. You're you. Why wait in long lines and fill out a mass of useless hard copy paperwork to get to the same place? The council does everything by the book. They've had thousands of years to write it. Sometimes things need to get done without a committee. I think you're pretty fair. You're not big on formalities, are you? I'm with them right up until they keep people from doing their jobs. There. I just saved you about nine days of running around. That said, you should head up to the Presidium and tell them you're still alive. The Council probably wants to talk to the one who saved their scaly asses. Uh, how do I get to the... What's the easiest way to get to the Presidium from down here? Head back through the security checkpoint and take a public shuttle. Okay, that's my plan, though. I will. Having access to the council and the Spectre's resources would be useful. Yeah, the council can get anything. Best thing about working CSEC is that any equipment, information, or money you need, you get. Anyway, something else you need? Or can I get back to work? Are you abusing suspects? I overheard your conversation. Make him scream a little. This isn't the Presidium. All they have to worry about are protesters outside their free speech zones or someone's poodle crapping on the grass. Down here, we have drugs, organized crime, and murder. Policing a ward is like policing New York City. Sometimes you have to work outside the Council's rulebook. Okay. It looks like most of the damage from Sovereign's attack has been repaired. The Presidium was pretty shot up. Of course, they fixed that first. All the wards got hit with debris when the ship exploded. Most of the damage was superficial, and the keepers got things restored fast. Tasery ward got the worst. A big chunk hit near the Dillanaga concert hall. They're still clearing wreckage and trying to get power restored. Okay, that's not great. Um. I need to talk to the council. Oh, I've, I've already done that. Through the security checkpoint and take a public. Secure ward. Tell me about this place. All the wards are more or less multicultural, but the other four are dominated by Asari, Turians, or Solarians. In Zakira, we've got major enclaves of Volus, Elcor, and Hanar. There's also a human commercial zone at Shinakiba. Right, so a good amount of everyone, which I, I got like. A few Krogan walking around, and I think I saw a quarry in the other day. Tally? Last time I was here, there were no human captains in CSEC. The CSEC took a lot of casualties when the Geth boarded the Presidium. The Special Response Division was hard hit. 
They stopped turning their noses up at human resumes. They needed bodies in uniform, and we had the most experienced bodies. Okay. I should be going. You need anything else? Let me know. Bit of a brute, but it works. I can't get into the interrogation room. That's upsetting. Hmm. Okay, quite a lot here. Let's talk to Avina. Welcome back, Shepard. It has been two years, three months, and 17 days since the Citadel last welcomed you. This is the Zakara Ward Transportation Hub. Public shuttles and shopping are available through the CSEC security cordon. What's with the CSEC presence? There seem to be a lot more CSEC officers than the last time I was here. In the wake of the Geth attack two years ago, additional security precautions were implemented for the safety and security of residents. In addition to increased CSEC patrols, weapon carry restrictions have been tightened. Uh, did it work? So has crime decreased? Violent crime has decreased by 23%. Property crime has decreased by 41%. Incident clearance has improved by 16%. Well, that's statistics. That doesn't mean it's been doing run right. Anyway, uh, how are things after Sovereign attack? It looks like this place has recovered from Sovereign's attack. Repair of the damage from the Geth attack is ongoing. There is still extensive damage on Taser Reward. What about the Reaper? Geth? It was Sovereign who led the attack. A Reaper. I have no information on a Reaper. References to the term exist in some parahistorical theories on galactic extinction cycles. They've suppressed information about the Reapers. Far easier to blame the Geth, a known enemy. Okay, so they're kind of covering it up. Tell me about the stores. What stores are available on this level? Only one store exists on this level. Oh. Citadel Souvenirs offers licensed mementos of your visit. Their line of Starship models is well regarded. That's all for now. Thank you for using Avena. Have a pleasant day. Okay. A news report. Welcome to Citadel. Emily Wong. I'm Emily Wong. Officials in the Systems Alliance remain tight-lipped about the recent disaster on the pioneer colony of Freedom's Progress. The human outpost is believed to have been destroyed with no survivors on record. Details are sketchy due to a news blackout. This is the latest in a series of frontier settlements lost by the Alliance. The Hanar Shrine of the Enkindlers plans a prayer vigil for the deceased. The Hanar maintain that the lost colonies are the Prothean's wrath. After human explorers defiled a Prothean data beacon two years ago on Eden Prime. Okay, so the Hanar might not like me too much right now. Ah, oh, some Krogan chilling here. I heard that those lakes up on the Presidium are filled with fish. No, they're not. You ever been up there? No. CSEC won't let me. They say I'm a risk. Uh, they think every Krogan is dangerous. Damn Turians. We should kill them all. <laughs> Krogan. I love them. Citadel Souvenirs. Hi. Good day, my friends. Welcome to the Citadel. Want an endorsement? Since these stores are owned by the council, do government employees get a discount? Yes, in fact. Uh, what's your position? I'm a former Spectre. My goodness. I didn't know Spectres quit. I don't believe you qualify for a discount, though. What? If I throw in an endorsement from the man who defeated Sarah. You are Shepard? My goodness. The increase in sales would certainly be worth offering a discount. What do you need me to do? Just voice your endorsement into my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Excellent. I will get my clerical VI to add it to our advertising immediately. Well, I didn't know if I meant to do that, but I did. Welcome back. These stores are owned by the Citadel, right? That's correct. Citadel Souvenirs outlets are owned by the council government. The profits generated by sales are used to maintain the station. We offer an assortment of decorations suitable for display in your personal quarters. So you have dis you, 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 you have dis course, things citizen. to display. Oh, souvenirs. A space hamster. Some fish. And some models of ships. Not really what I wanted to buy uh, with my credits. I'm not going to lie. And I just got a fucking discount on that, of all things. That was possibly the worst thing for me to get. Could I have gotten a discount on other stores? And I've just gotten a discount on fucking ships. 
Ah, uh, that's annoying. Um, in this right-hand area, there's some more areas to explore. Let's go right. We'll just take it as we go. Try and explore. Apex Omni Tools. Oh. Very cool. Saronis Applications. Galactic News. Okay. A little interesting, but it is what it is. Hi. What can I do for you? Want an endorsement? Your expeditions might be a little tame for me. Tame? A human can hardly take down a feral veret, let alone a Shatha. Who do you think you are? Well, my name's Shepard, and... The Shepard? The one that put down Saren Arterius? Oh, yeah. Oh, you do know me. By the spirits. Shepard, in my store. I don't suppose I could convince you to record an advertisement for me. Sure you could. Can we work out a discount? A discount? I'd name my firstborn after you if you ask. Can we record it now? Just speak towards my console. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. <laughs> no other gun shop has that kind of endorsement. No other gun shop? Yes. <laughs> I, I'm just going to go around and say, I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store to every store. Ah, oh, sniper rifle damage. Sniper whiffle damage. Hello. Ammo packs. Vests for health. So that's a shield sniper. Ooh. Shield strength. Power damage. Oh, damn. Let's buy a weapon upgrade for more sniper rifle damage. I think that's going to be really useful. I would take the ammo. We'll take the ammo pack as well. And that's all we're going to take right now. I could take this, which is a shield based sniper. Hmm. Go on, we'll buy that as well. I could use a sniper rifle. There we go. So what do you think? Maybe a shotgun? I like the assault rifle. It's like a non-stop barrage of death. If you can hit anything. Okay. Interesting, and we're getting there. Let's keep exploring the Citadel. Have There's a game sales. I love that game. It's based on Turian mythology, but it's really fun. I hear it has 11 billion players now. Do you have any games you'd like to trade in? You get two credits toward a new game. You know what's good? Alliance Corsair. The battles are pretty realistic, but it's still fun. And you can install it on an Omni tool. Dark Star? That seems like a big area. Let's check it out. I got quite a big area to explore here. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, I'm just in awe. There's so many bright lights and stuff. It's very overstimulating. Oh my! Didn't quite expect that. And I can do for you. Are the fish on the Presidium? I noticed you're one of the groundskeepers for the Presidium. Do you know if there are fish in the lakes? I get that question a lot. I think it's right behind. Where's the restroom? Those are reservoirs. The Presidium's own supply, independent from the water storage tanks in the wards. The only place I know of on the station to get a live fish is the Leosanese gift shop. That's what we drink? When I pour a glass of water, it's the same stuff that tourists throw garbage in? No, they purify it first. If some solarian or human bacteria gets left in, and a Turian or Quarian drinks it, they could die. Everything would be so much simpler if we all had the same DNA. But no, the universe loves diversity. Pretty fair. Uh. I know that you're one of the great. Oh, I've already asked that question. Oh, the only place I know of where's that gift shop? In the market downstairs from the bar. God, the music's the loud. I'm gonna lower it. The largest pets most station residents can get a permit for. Thanks for your time. So, if you get up to the Presidium, check out the. I moved this down. Watch 
There we go. No, I have moved it down. It just reset it when I opened it. Uh, purchase the resized brandy. Go on. It's expensive, but we got it. We can give that to Dr. Chakras. What will it be? Hear about anything interesting going on around here? I serve drinks. You want to know what's going on? Check the news. I don't know why humans always ask me that. It's because you're a bartender. I want the strongest thing you have. Easy enough. This is... It's green. And guaranteed to knock you on your ass. Unless you're Dextro DNA like me. If you are, it'll kill you. Anything else? Give me another one! Well, let's have another one. There you are. Anything else? Not done yet. <laughs> I've never seen anyone take three of these. I don't think you ever will. Anything else? Roll on four. Hit me again. How about we mix it up? This is genuine Batarian ale. Uncut. Don't ask how I got it. I've been serving here eight years. I've never seen anyone have this and stay on their feet. Anything else? Yeah! Do it! Do it! <laughs> special. This is Krogan liquor, Rincon. You set off radiological alarms after you drink it. Should I pour you a quad? Uh, I can handle it. Oh yeah, put more of the stuff in the thing where stuff goes in. We're in the toilets. <laughs> okay, so that went, um, well. <laughs> Let's go back to him and see if we've got to have a chat. Let's talk to Miranda. Looking for a little R and R, Shepard. It's a nice enough place. A lot nicer than Cora's Den, anyway. I wasn't sorry to hear they never reopened after the Geth attack. Oh, I like Cora's Den. It was round. Oh yeah, we dancing. Shepard, master dancer. Jacob, you're not, you're not interested. Okay, cool. Well, we went to a club and basically nothing happened here other than me throwing up in a toilet. So pretty fun in the long run. Let's carry on exploring the Citadel. Ah. You! The people want to hear your story, Shepard. I punched you in the face last time. What's wrong with your eye? Oh. Kalisa been seen in Al Jalani, Westerman News. I interviewed you two years ago when you first became a Spectre. You punched me when my questions hit too close to home. Do you have a minute? Yeah, you made me look bad. What, so you can try to do another smear job on me? Your thuggish response and the facts did the job, Shepard, not me. Your back, your news. I just want to give your story its due. Uh huh. Sources claim you were at the heart of the Presidium during the Battle of the Citadel. It's fair to say the course of the battle hinged on your words. 
If true, you told Admiral Hackett to assist the Destiny Ascension, costing hundreds of human lives. And I'm not going to punch. Continued dominance of the Citadel Council. We stood as one to save many. The Turians lost 20 cruisers. Figure each had a crew around 300. The Ascension, the Asari Dreadnought we saved, had a crew of nearly 10,000. But surely the human cost. The Alliance lost eight cruisers. Chen Yang, Emden, Jakarta, Cairo, Seoul, Cape Town, Warsaw, Madrid. And yes, I remembered them all. Everyone in the Fifth Fleet is a hero. The Alliance owes them all medals. The Council owes them a lot more than that. And so do you. Commander Shepard, first human specter. Hero of the Battle of the Citadel. Check bid. We get it? Aye, we did it. Great. Bull rushed on my own show. Yep. Yeah. And I didn't punch you in the face. Ah, <sighs> thank goodness. I was very close to thinking it would be a good idea, but it was Renegade, and I can't do Renegade stuff because that's bad. At least I'm trying not to. There are no survivors. In a purely human manner, what is happening? I'm liking the advertisements. Okay, we have done everything there. Let's head left and check out the other way down the city. Because there's a cafe over there. Let's check out a cafe. Because we've got more places to go on the Citadel. I like exploring these areas. But it's important we actually properly explore these areas. Captain Hannah Shepard has apparently turned down an I should probably tell my mom I'm alive. It's just occurred to me. There are no fish. What do you want? I talked to one of the Presidium groundskeepers. He said there aren't any fish in the lakes. What? I told you. Why have all that water if you're not going to store something to eat in it? I don't understand aliens at all. Thanks for telling me. It's all he's talked about all damn day. <laughs> this is depressing. <laughs> I've just made a Krogan depressed by telling them there's no fish. That always makes you feel better. Oh, bless them. I love Krogans. They're like big babies. That's the best way I can put it, and I love them. Anyway, let's um I hear this is the best place for food on Zakara Ward. You heard wrong. This is the best place for food on the whole damn citadel. Oh. High grade provisions and some novels. You know what? I'll buy some novels. And we will buy the high grade provisions as well. Very important. Done. We've got some high grade provisions for our cook. Bless him. Cook, chef, janitor. Tombs! Yes! They were, and we were there. We can totally help with that. That was the first. Qu that was the quest. 
Ah. Oh. The Systems Alliance Parliamentary Subcommittee for Transhuman Studies has awarded reparations for biotics suffering complications from LTE. That's that's part all of our side quests. Oh my god, it's it's all our side quests. The Turian government is considering further reparations to humans whose ancestors died in the Relay 314 incident at Shashi. The Turian government previously made reparations from what humans call the First Contact War, but refused to pay interest. The Turian hierarchy has supported improved relations with humanity since the Alliance's heroic sacrifice defending the Citadel from Saren's attack two years ago. I'm sorry, I'm absolutely loving this. So just rolling around the station, even though it takes me a while to get from A to B, we're still gaining stuff because we're learning little bits about how our side quests have affected everything. Now, is there a store here? Are you ship salesman? Hello. Greetings, Earth Clan. You will find many excellent ships for sale here. Only slightly used, yes. With our Unification Day special, you can get up to 2,000 credits back. Mm. Such a deal. I don't need a ship. I'm good, thanks. Alright. We're now in this area. We'll go right and work our way around. Hi, Chef. You ever had ramen? It's a delicacy back on Earth. Okay. There's some El Coral. Now available on video, the abridged version of Francis Kitt's award-winning production of Hamlet, featuring an all El Cor cast. Oh! I'm saying this now. This was referenced in one of the lifts in the Mass Effect 1, and I'm loving it's come up again. An unforgettable 14 hour experience. <laughs> Insincere <laughs> endorsement. Sorry, Hold on. I'm trying to take a statement here. There's nothing to talk about. She stole my credit shit. Arrest her. I did not. Just because I'm a quarian. I need you to stop and take a deep breath. You're mocking me, Earth Clan. Just because the Vault Clan need it was a poor choice of words, sir. I apologize. All right. You say you're falsely accused? I was walking to the used ship dealer when he barged into me outside the Serta Foundation. He didn't stop or say he was sorry. A minute later, he runs up with C-Sec and accuses me of stealing his damn ship. Okay. You look at ships a lot? Do you spend a lot of time at the used ship dealer? Yeah. They've got a lot of nice models. I'd like to buy one and take it back to the fleet, but... You're on your pilgrimage. That's a great idea. A ship would make a great pilgrimage gift. You know about the pilgrimage? I traveled with a quarian who was on hers. I... Wow. I didn't know anyone here would do that for one of us. Oh, she's nice. What's the C-Sec opinion? Do you know who's telling the truth? My Omni-Tool can tell the quarian doesn't have a chit on her. But she could have stashed it to recover later. You know what quarians are like. <laughs> and she's definitely a vagrant. I'll run her in and racist. see what Bailey wants to do with her. No, you're not going to do that. The Volus? You say she stole your credit chip? She must have. When I left the Serta Foundation store, she ran right into me. She ran into you? How does running India mean she stole your credit chip? That's how pickpockets work. They bump into you and use that as a cover for rifling your pockets. You can't turn your back on these clanless quarians. Thieves. All of them. Did you leave it at the store? Are you sure you didn't leave your chit at the Serta Foundation? Of course not. You think I'd make a mistake like that? Yes. I didn't even buy anything there. That chit stayed in my pocket. I'll look into this situation. I'll see if I can find out what happened. Sir, this is a C-Sec matter. We'll do all we can... All we can to resolve this. We don't need civilian help. 
you do happen to find the chit, please let one of our officers know. Let's go. Be careful out there. So. She said she was at the U-ship place, which We're is over here. There's a Volus outside who lost his credit chit. Did you happen to see him drop it anywhere? I don't recall any other Vol clan entering my showroom today. Just that migrant clan girl putting her fingers all over the brochures again. There's a Volus outside oh, okay. who lost his credit chit. Did you happen to see him drop it anywhere? Mm, the meat isn't fresh out here, but you won't find any better dried seaweed on the station. Moki? I felt her hand go into my pocket when I checked my credit. Okay, so where is Serta? Serta's down here. This is a warehouse. Let's check out the warehouse just because we can. And then we'll go there. No. We'll check out a warehouse just because we can. Very uh, tight around here. I was wondering if there might be stuff around here, but there's not. Okay. So there's a warehouse there. Let's go to the Cert Foundation and see if he left it behind there. And then if not, maybe we can find it between here and there. Hmm. This is the Serta Foundation. Let's have a chat with her. Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation outlet on Zakira Ward. Want an endorsement? I couldn't help but notice your prices. They seem a bit steep. With respect, the Foundation is not concerned with profits. A portion of our sales funds research to cure genetic diseases. You know what would make your services more popular? An endorsement from the man who defeated Saren. Oh my! You're <laughs> I would be glad to give you my employee discount. How know. many people can I get away with this? Just speak into my console here. I'm Commander Shepard. And this is my favorite store on the Citadel. <laughs> I'll work it into our advertising at once. Thank you. Oh my god. I've done it so many times. It's just going to walk around in the future. It's gonna be, I'm Commander Shepard. I'm Commander Shepard. Good day, citizen. Welcome to the Serta Foundation. A Volus was in here not too long ago. Did he drop a credit chip? And now that I saw, he didn't purchase anything. Mm, what's your job? If everything's done by catalog, why are you here? Customer service. Returns, exchanges, and the group rates. We also find that sales are better when there's someone to personally interact with. Although I'm not sure why a human company exclusively hires a sari to work their stores. Uh, okay. Thanks for your time. Come back soon, Shepard. A med gel capacity and life support webbing. 10% extra health is really good. Let's buy that. And med gel capacity would be pretty good. But I'm not actually using as much as I thought I would. So I'm going to keep that off for now. We don't need to spend it. Right. I've yet to find it. So between here and there. It's got to be a credit chip. You know what quarians are like. They take anything. Sir, I'm going to have to ask you to calm down. Let me try Avina. Welcome. The Zakara Ward Marketplace provides shopping and storage space for the less privileged... That's all for now. Thank you for using Avina. Have you claim you didn't. Please move along. You say you're falsely accused? I was walking to the used ship dealer when he barged into me outside the Serta Foundation. He didn't stop or say he was sorry. A minute later, he runs up with C-Sec and accuses me of stealing his damn chit. Did the chit fell? He ran fell into full. each other outside the Serta Foundation. Is it possible the chit fell out of his pocket there? I guess. Sure, all I know is I didn't take it. Okay. Let's go. Be careful out there. So outside Serta Foundation would be here. Do you have a chit? Hmm. Marab. Welcome to Sarenus application. Can I interest you? Ah, Shepard. Do I know you? No, but I know you. Even a senile Hanar would remember the human who fought off the Geth. I thought you were dead. Yeah, I've been getting that a lot. Please, look around the store. It's a pleasure to have you here. Want an endorsement? You know, I use quite a bit of software in my line of work. It's 
a shame so few understand their own equipment. Besides the most obvious point and go nav interfaces, anyway. You wouldn't believe how often I hear, why is the ship turning around? We're only halfway there. <laughs> oh, I would. You know, I like your products. Any interest in an endorsement from the human who defeated Saren? I'd be thrilled. But I don't think I could afford to pay you for it. Don't worry about it. What if we just work out a discount? Absolutely. <laughs> just console here. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. That will be splendid. I can edit that and have it working right away. Thank you so much. How am I getting Paragon for this? Uh, tech damage is very useful. Damage protection's incredible. Reduces recharge time of my powers. Hmm. That is pretty much all my money right now to uh, have a look at these right now. So we'll come back. Uh, did you find out about uh, the chit? My favorite customer. What can I get you? A bolus was in here not too long ago. Did he drop a credit chit? Oh, yes. He bought some environmental system drivers, then left without his chit. I didn't notice he'd left until he was already gone. If you see him, tell him I have it here behind the counter. Thank you. Bye. Thanks for your time. I'll be here if you need anything. Goddamn idiots. All right, we'll tell them what's happened. Are you sure you're being straight with me? There's nothing you want to admit? What? Why are you... Please move along. You forgot your credit chit at Saronis Applications. The clerk is holding it for you. Oh. Well. The Quarian could have stolen it. I'll close this event report, but I'll be watching you. Get a permanent residence, or I'll run you in for vagrancy. Are you too serious? I got it. What? You falsely accused this girl of stealing from you. All you have to say now is that she could have stolen it? Now, just a minute. And you? She gets harassed and insulted by this guy, and you throw in a threat to arrest her for vagrancy? How about if I run you in for obstruction of justice? You think you're gonna run in a former specter? I think both of you should get out of here. Oh, son of a... <laughs> I wish I could give you something more than words. Are you gonna be cool? Can you take care of yourself from here? I guess. I mean, most nights I eat nutrient paste in a Turian shelter. But I'm surviving. Thanks. Well, if only I could get her the credit she needs for that used ship, I genuinely would give her that so she can help her fi finish her pilgrimage. Six cans of beer on tap. Um, other than this, I think... Hold on, let me open the map. We have done everything. There's a comm terminal over there that I've not interacted with. I didn't even see it though. I'm Commander Shepard, and this is my favorite store on the Citadel. Oh god. That's the one we destroyed on the moon. Quite cool. The development comes as a result of samples contaminated during a Could I interest you in a Turian Esperance sporting shuttle? No, we're good. I think we're good now. We just need to rapid transit out of the wards. Uh, as soon as I find one. Oh yeah. So that person's still a large from the uh, Skyfall. Whatever we're calling it. There, right. Let's try and see where we can fly in here with the rapid transit. Normandy, I can request new squad members. Oh, hello. You know what? We'll bring Miranda and we'll bring Katsumi. Because she's quite cool. She's got Shadow Strike Overload, Flashbangs. Very cool. I'm just curious what they'll do. And I kind of want to get to know her. We're all good there. Ah. She looks very edgy. 
Right. Oh, so I, that the entirety of what I just did. Oh, no, no. Okay, so this is all that. The Presidium is separate, though. Let's go to the Presidium, then. Ah, Anderson. God, this place is posh. This meeting would be more productive if Udina was to join us. My advisor is unavailable. As counselor, I represent the voice of humanity and the Alliance. Shepard will be here and... Oh, Commander. We were just talking about you. It's good to see you, old friend. It's been a long time, Anderson. I hope the last couple of years have treated you right. There have been some rough spots. It's good to have you back. We've heard many rumors surrounding your unexpected return. Some of them are... unsettling. We called this meeting so you could explain your actions, Shepard. We owe you that much. After all, you saved our lives in the battle against Saren and his Geth. I need your help. The Collectors are abducting human colonists in the Terminus systems. Worse, we think they're working for the Reavers. The Terminus systems are beyond our jurisdiction. Your colonists knew this when they left Council Space. You're missing the important part, Counselor. The Reapers are involved. Ah yes, Reapers. The immortal race of sentient starships allegedly waiting in dark space. Uh, we have dismissed that claim. <sighs> Shepard, no one else encountered the hologram on Ilos that told you the truth about the Reapers. Only you and your crew ever spoke with Sarah. I believe you. But without evidence from another source, the others think Saren was behind the Geth attacks. So I need to find people. Examine Vigil or Sovereign? Saren was an organic. The Geth would never accept him as their leader. They only followed him because he was Sovereign's agent. That's fair. Saren was a compelling and charismatic individual. He convinced the Geth the Reapers were real, just as he convinced you. Oh, not this again. Plan to attack the Citadel. The Reapers are just a myth. One you insist on perpetuating. We believe that you believe it, but that doesn't make it true. Okay. Go back to Ilos and talk to Vigil. Or just look at what's left of Sovereign. It's obvious the technology is more advanced than ours. The hologram on Ilos is no longer functional. And we have found nothing to suggest that Sovereign was not a Geth creation. The Geth are capable of remarkable technological achievements. This is probably why Saren recruited them. This Reaper theory proves just how fragile your mental state is. You have been manipulated by Cerberus, and before them, by Saren. I deserve better than this. I kept Saren from conquering the Citadel. I sacrificed human lives to save this council. We are in a difficult position, Shepard. You are working for Cerberus, an avowed enemy of the council. This is treason, a capital offense. That's too far. Shepard is a hero. I'm on this council too, and I won't let this whitewash continue. Maybe there is a compromise, not a public acknowledgement given your ties, but something to show peripheral support. Shepard, if you keep a low profile and restrict your operations to the Terminus systems, the council is willing to offer you reinstatement as a spectre. A reinstatement? What does that mean? Will I need to start filing reports? That won't be necessary. This is a show of good faith on our part. We cannot become involved in an investigation regarding the missing colonies in the Terminus systems. But Spectre reinstatement shows our support of you personally. Okay. It's the best we can do. I accept your offer. It's good to have the Council on my side. Good luck with your investigation, Shepard. We hope for a quick resolution and a quick end to your relationship with Cerberus. Well, that went better than expected. You realize the Council's offer is just symbolic. They won't actually do anything. But there's no need to burn bridges. Even if they don't help, I might as well stay on good terms. True enough. Don't worry about the Council or the Alliance. I'll find some way to keep them off your back. Shouldn't be too hard. As long as you keep to the Terminus systems. Anderson, we need to talk about... Shepard. What are you doing here? I'm visiting an old friend. I'd like to see how Anderson was doing. You don't have to cover for me. I invited Shepard here to speak with the Council. We just finished our meeting. You what? Counselor, 
Do the words political shitstorm mean anything to you? The amazing went from. The council reinstated my Spectre status. They're just happy I'm staying out with the Terminus systems. Yes, I could see how that arrangement works best for both sides. But you really shouldn't have taken a step like this without consulting with me first, Counselor. I don't answer to you, Udina. Why don't you go to your office and think about that for a while? Of course, Counselor. Good day to both of you. Udina hates us, that's Sorry good. That. Udina's never gotten over the fact that I got the council position instead of him. Sometimes I need to put him in his place. Udina's just doing his job. True enough. He's got his uses. And if you want something done on the Citadel, he knows who can make it happen. Plus, he's always happy to attend all those formal diplomatic functions I can't be bothered with. Let's investigate. Where's Caden? What happened to Staff Lieutenant Olenko after the Normandy was destroyed? Staff Commander Olenko is still with the Alliance. But he's working on a special mission. It's classified. I can't say any more. Not while you're working with Cerberus. I'm sorry. God damn it. Uh, damage to the Citadel. How long did it take to get this place back up to speed after the battle? Still counting. The main areas of commerce and the most populated wards are complete. But estimates for total restoration are sitting around five years. The Keepers okay. always surprise us, though. It's like our repairs are annoying. We'll put up an ugly new bulkhead, and in a few days, they've made it seamless. We never really thought of them as heavy lifters, and I have no idea where they get the resources. But we'd never get done without them. That's good. Uh, how's the remains of Sovereign? What have happened to them? I'm surprised no one can tell Sovereign isn't get technology. Didn't they examine the wreckage? We don't have much to look at. Pieces have been rained all over the station. It was chaos. With who knows how many species combing the wards for their dead. We secured as much of it as we could. But between the keepers and a whole lot of unauthorized salvage, there's no way to account for even half of that thing. Right. The reason why they don't want to acknowledge what Sovereign was. That's fair, actually. Most of it's missing. They could use it for weapons or anything. So that's not good that they've only got half of it. Last I knew, we were still fighting holdouts. We're here and there. But they are increasingly disorganized. It's long since stopped being called a war. More like cleanup. Not that you can ever discount them. But we haven't had serious casualties for months. A civilian ship will spot an enclave and we send in a squad to clear it. They're not quite the boogeymen they used to be. So how are you? How have the last couple of years treated you? Serving on the council isn't how I plan to spend my twilight years. Sometimes it feels like I'm just beating my head against a wall. Knowing the truth about Sovereign is brutal. It's nightmare stuff. I can't blame others for not wanting to believe it, but I know how important it is. So I keep trying. Fighting the good fight, right? It's true. You should come with me, Forget though. Udina and the Council. Join my crew and help me stop the Collectors. I'm too old to go racing across the galaxy. Much as I complain, I've got an important job to do here. The front line, that's got to be yours. All right, well, see you later, then. I better go. Of course, Shepard, I understand. I wish I could do more to help you. But if you ever want to talk, I'll be here. Just do me a favor and be careful. You can't trust Cerberus. I know, I know. Let's try talking to you again, just very quickly. Something I can do for you, Shepard? Uh, no, okay. I better go. My door is always open. Anything I can do here? No, there's some news over there. Oh, okay, so there's nowhere else to go. Right, let's go back to the Normandy. And then next time, we're going to go and get ourselves a scientist for the ship so we can work on upgrading our gear. And then we're going to do a little bit of a grind with some side quests to really top off our gear. But, for now, while I'm on the Normandy, we can go and hand in the extra food supplies we've picked up. Because that will be beneficial to the chef, which is downstairs. The crew quarters. Because I think that's the only quest I've actually got to hand in right now. Let me just check. Open my journal. Quite a lot here. Assignments. 
Oh, I got the brandy for chakras as well. That's right. And that's it. Yeah. So let's hand this in with you. Hello. Commander, those provisions you provided were perfect. I owe you. I've already thrown together some of my calamari gumbo. Here, try a bite. Okay. Truth told, it's based on an Asari recipe. Seems a little cannibalistic to me with their tentacle heads and all, but they ain't no good grub. Anyway, thanks again. You really came through. How can I help you, Commander? Need anything else? You have everything you need. Absolutely. Since you set up my kitchen with proper supplies, thanks again. Nice. I won't take any more of it. Back to work. That'll help the morale out a little bit anyway. And uh, let's go in here and give Chakras her whiskey. Or brandy or whatever it is. How may I help you, Commander? I have a present for you, Doc. Sarah's ice brandy? You didn't. <laughs> Thank you. Got to sort out my crew. I regretted not opening that original bottle when I still could. I won't make the same mistake again. Why don't we open this bottle right here, right now, you and me? Let's drink. You crack open the bottle. I'll get the glasses. <laughs> I thought Olenko's biotic display might have broken Jenkins' back, but Jenkins pops up and yells, That was awesome! Ah, oh, Jenkins. <laughs> oh, Jenkins. Soldiers like him make the Alliance great. Cerberus lacks the same enthusiasm. Uh, a toast to the Alliance. Here's to the men and women of the Alliance. May fortune find them all. Bless. Oh. She had a bit much. Oh, we've had a bit much, I see. We're a little drunk. Oh well, that is a perfect time to end this episode. Because I've got no more quests to hand in, and we've got plenty to do off in the world. So what we're going to do is next time we are going to set out and try and find the professor to unlock the science lab so we can actually research better gear. I'm just going to have a quick check at my messages. Nothing here. What about upgrades? Sniper rifle damage, one out of five. That's pretty fair. And our team status. Not that bad. I suppose I should talk to Kasumi. But I don't know where she is. Let me talk to Kelly and see if there's anything. When we spoke, you were very open with me. I like that. But I hope I didn't come across as too flirty. I don't want to overstep my bounds. Uh, informal's fine. Be yourself, Kelly. We don't need military protocol getting in the way. I agree completely. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? How's the crew? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? No, nope. goodbye. Up. I'll be here if you need anything. Okay, I will save and we'll call this episode here. So thank you very much for watching. Much love. And next time, we will continue with some actual quests.